Hey guys, Patrice here with another haul video. Um, this is going to be a short video and the next one's going to be a short video. I was going to do these in um, the same video, but uh, I know a lot of people, um, it's a big faux pas or they just don't like mixing vendors. So they're going to be kind of short. So um, I had received a package, a friend mail uh, from one of my friends. Um, she knew that I wanted to try Teddy Bees, um, and I ha she doesn't ship to Canada directly, and I don't do the third-party shipping, so she was very generous enough to send me some Teddy Bees for me to try out, so I'm just going to quickly go through my friend mail from her, and then I'm going to end the video and jump into another video, so... This is, she sent a good chunk of a loaf of Teddy Bee Seaside Siesta, which is um, creamy coconut, golden sands, and lavender. I looked up the notes on the Teddy Bee's Facebook. This one's beautiful. Um, definitely get that golden sands and that lavender. And a little tiny bit of the creamy coconut. This is going to be perfect for summer, like July. That's really nice. Um, the next is Country Fair, which is kettle of corn, soft pretzels, and fried ice cream. That's what she sent me. And I definitely get that pretzel with a little bit of the kettle corn. Mmm, that one's so good. Love that. The next, she sent me a whole soup of clay of ice cream for breakfast vanilla ice cream, caramel, fruit loops, and vanilla sugar waffle cone. I'm definitely getting the Fruit Loops and caramel. Not getting much of the vanillas, but that's okay. That's nice too. It's kind of on the lighter side, but it might be the age too. It doesn't have a date on it, but uh, the next is Teddy Bee's Long Farewell, which is Palo Santo Twilight Woods Pink Sugar with a hint of lavender and vanilla. Mm, you definitely get that Palo Santo. I'm not getting much else. Maybe that Twilight Woods. Not much pink sugar or lavender or vanilla, but that one's nice if you like Palo Santo. Next one is her infamous Christmas trees and cream. Fresh pine boughs, vanilla sugar waffle cone, and rich vanilla buttercream. That's that. Oh, this one does have a poor date. 10 09 20 and This one's great. I, I, I love this just like everyone else. I would buy that in loaves beautiful the next ivory bag because it was in like a different kind of baggy um, it is Milky Way roses which is boardwalk marshmallow sweet lavender and rose milk and I get a lot of that rose milk but it's blended nice with that boardwalk marshmallow so it's not too much the next is cookies for Santa which is a blend of frosted sugar cookies and milk and cookies This is so good. Definitely get that frosted sugar cookie. Mmm, that one's really good. I get that in a loaf too. Um, the next is uh, Milk of the Poppy, which is Palo Santo and the richest, creamiest vanilla. And again, you get, yeah, you get the Palo Santo, but you definitely get a creamy vanilla. Really good. Next, she sent me a sample of Tiff's Favorite Lavender. I've heard so much about this. This is Lavender Sweet Marshmallow and Vanilla Coconut Milk. Oops. And I definitely get that sweet, like it's like a sweet lavender with coconut cream or coconut milk, I guess. Beautiful. Love it. Um, the next is going to be Granny's Host, which is Warm Oatmeal Raisin Cookie, Shortbread Cookies, and Pie Crust. Oh, I get that oatmeal raisin cookie. That's one of my favorite smells. I love this. Save that to a while. The next one is Beaches of Narth, um, but I think it's called something else, um, too. Um, apple infused coconut water, tropical fruit, citrus, berries, tuberose, suntan lotion, warm driftwood. 
This one you definitely get like um, a driftwoody tuberose scent, but very sweet from the apple and coconut milk. This one's nice. Not one that I think I would pick up again, but I think it's going to be really nice for the summer. The next is Teddy Bee's Milk and Cookies. These are all Teddy Bee's, so I don't need to keep repeating that, I guess. Um, milk and Cookies, Cream and Vanilla, Powder, Sugar, Sweet Milk, and Buttery Cookie Dough. This is, again, Heaven. This is a fan favorite, I think, and it's, I can see why. This is also a fan favorite, I believe. It's Blackberry. What is it? Blackberry... So this one says blackberry pecan cookies, but I think there's another word behind, I think Danish, blackberry Danish, or no, blackberry butter pecan cookies, sorry. So it's butter pecan waffles, blackberry jam, and butter cookies. So good. So good. Definitely get like that pecan scent with the blackberry uh, jam butter cookies. Really nice. This one is blueberry cheesecake waffles, which is blueberries, creamy cheesecake, butter, pecan waffles, and maple syrup. So she it's this whole loaf. This one must have been sitting. It's so soft. I don't even want to take it out. I definitely get a cheesecake note with a little bit of blueberry. This is lighter. So this one might be on the older side too, but I'm definitely going to give that a try. Um, next one is Three-Eyed Raven. Palo Santo, Sweet Lavender, Vanilla Birch, Marshmallow, Fireside, and Cold Air. This is definitely a Palo Santo, but you definitely get that Marshmallow Fireside. That's mainly what I'm getting, but it's very nice. Her Palo Santo is very good. Um, the next one is Off the Strip. It's a big chunk of a loaf, which is Berry Sorbet, Light Coconut, Soothing Sandalwood, and Warm Musk. This one's so good. This one is probably one of my favorites. Definitely get that berry sorbet, but there's like that watery coconut, very soothing scent. That one's beautiful. And I do believe that's a lot. The last thing I have here is she sent me a whole big clam of Winterfell. Marshmallow, Fireside, Palo Santo, White Birch, Icy Snow, and Vanilla. You definitely get, sorry, I have to keep looking. Definitely get a marshmallow and a Palo Santo, but you definitely get that icy, that white birch. This one blended beautifully. It's definitely not of this time of year scent, but I'm gonna really enjoy this all in the winter. So that is my friend mail. Thank you, Sarah, so much for sending me this to try. This is very generous of you. And if any of you guys have favorites of Teddy Bees, let me know. Like I said, I've never ordered from her. I would like to. Um, I really wish she was shipped to Canada because I've paid exact shipping before. And I don't mind it when I love something. So anyways, guys, I'm going to get right into filming the next video. And I hope to see you there.